Hey guys, welcome back to Suitcase Princess. My name is Shauna, and if you are new here, we come here to encourage you to take your kids and get out of the house. We come here and we share what we are learning along the way to help you find more fun in what you're doing, find more value in the dollars that you're spending, and to do it all with a little bit less stress. So today, I wanted to come here and I wanted to share with you our last weekday at the water park, Palm Beach in Moody Gardens. Guys, before we go any further, please scroll down, hit the big red subscribe button, turn on the bell for notifications, and give this video a thumbs up. As always, you can find us right on down in the comments and over on Instagram at Suitcase Princess. We, if you are new here and do not know, are a homeschooling family of four. So we homeschool, uh, we are in the Houston area, and we only homeschool four days a week. That is so that we can take advantage of the fact that everyone else is in school and enjoy some fun and amazing offerings in and around the Houston area, one of which being Palm Beach at Moody Gardens. So this year, and I do not know why, these schools in our area are starting all the way from August 9th to HISD and SciFair are starting August 28th. So there is a very wide spread of when the schools, the school districts in our area are starting. I feel like it's never been this this broad. Um, so we are still, from the time of filming this, awaiting people to go back to school. But we did take advantage of the fact that Galveston ISD schools had not started yet. And so we went and enjoyed the last weekday that Palm Beach at Moody Gardens will be open for the 2023 summer season. Now, I am gonna pop over and show you our day because it was amazingly deserted. It was so fantastic. The girls and I had the absolute best time. It was chill, it was relaxing, it was wonderful, but, Travel tip, be sure to check school holidays for the places that you are traveling. Something that I have learned is that a lot of schools in Europe, because we are looking at a European vacation next year, a lot of schools in Europe are off of school at different times. In the US, it's very customary to have a Christmas break and a long summer, whereas other places, that is not necessarily the case. In England, for example, and the UK, they have a midterm break, so they go to school for about six weeks, take a break, and then they also have a little bit longer half-term break, which is at like summertime. So these are things that you should keep in mind because even a lot of people will wonder why Disney will get so busy in October and in the fall. And that's because a lot of schools actually have a fall break. I know where I went to school, they had a fall break because it was the county fair, a heavily agricultural area. And so they literally shut down the high schools, the schools for a week so that people could participate in those agricultural events. Also, um, there is a long break in February. I think it's called Jersey Week. And so Disney tends to get really busy because schools in New Jersey are closed. So looking and taking into account school holidays for the places that you're going to visit can really, really decrease crowds, decrease costs, things like that. So keep things like that in mind when you are looking at your travel options. Now, let's pop on over and go to Palm Beach. Today, the suitcase princesses and I are taking advantage of the very last open weekday here at Palm Beach in Moody Gardens. Um, we headed down, we, uh, well, we homeschool, we do four day weeks, and that means we have one day for something fun or something extra. And this week, that means we are headed to, as I've already said, the last weekday open of Palm Beach at Moody Gardens. You guys know we're members. We absolutely love Moody Gardens. We love coming to Galveston. Um, it holds a very special place in our hearts and in our lives, and we enjoy it every chance that we get. This morning, the girls and I headed down early and started with Star Drug. I will be sure to insert a little bit of footage of that because it's so adorable. Uh, it's like an old style, like soda fountain restaurant, breakfast, lunch. Adorable, adorable. We love it. Good food, great food, locally owned. A, a real gem here on the island, to be honest with you. So now we are gonna head in and enjoy Palm Beach. Okay, hoping the audio is not garbage since they're in the waterproof couch, but we're here. It's 1027, we're screened, we're fully ready to go. Okay, so they have these amazing, like, water rinse off they've got bottle fill right here by the front restroom life jackets ices ice cream there's the lazy river the tower slides full bar cabana rentals lockers and gift shop 
as well as first aid up here. So everything you could need. And like I said, today we're just gonna take you along and hopefully have a wonderful time. Last, you know, daytime summer fun excursion. There's the river. As you can see, lots of people, lots of people today, huh? It's gonna be an amazing day. We've got more concessions over here that are open and will be open still later. And we're gonna find our spot in the sand. Okay, so the girls are gonna go do the tower slide. Can you look at this view, please? It's amazing. Stunning, stunning views. Here's the water park, which is still so chill and calm today. Now let's see which girl comes out first. Oh, I saw a body. Guys, I hope that you found any of this helpful, entertaining, or informative. If you did, please scroll down, hit the big red subscribe button, and turn on the bell for notifications. As always, you can find us right on down in the comments and over on Instagram at Suitcase Princess. Don't forget that tip of checking the school holidays before booking your travels because this really can impact crowd levels a significant amount and also impact those costs. If you're wondering why, you know, one leg of your flights is drastically expensive, if you're traveling at a time when schools have just gotten out, it's because everybody's out and it's gonna be a more expensive fare. So keep things like that in mind when you are planning and preparing your vacation travels, holiday travels, fun travels, adventures.